We are going to start a new video series on the KDF microcontroller, and this time we are going to program it through C programming. So, first of all, uh, we need to answer a very important question why uh, should we program in C? Right? So, if we are programming microcontroller, pick 18 uh, or any other microcontroller, then why do we need to program in C? So, this is the very first question that one needs to uh, answer. Uh, and to understand this question, uh, we need to uh, understand certain facts. And that fact is about hex files that we know that whatever the language you are going to use uh, to program the microcontroller, at the end, you need a compiler which will convert uh, this code or this program into hex files or machine codes, which are eventually understandable for uh, microcontroller, right? And you know that these hex files, of course, are going to store in the ROM or the program memory of microcontroller. And uh, we are uh, quite aware about this fact that ROM is at the end is a limited resource and one need to use it efficiently. So that is why limited on-chip ROM is around uh, two megabytes if we are specifically talking about uh, pic 18 f microcontroller, right? Uh, let's explore this fact further by comparing uh, the C language and assembly language. So if we are going to make a choice of programming language, I mean, the language in which you are going to program your microcontroller, uh, so one need to aware about it that it actually does affect the size of what? Hex file. At the end, this is the hex file in which any programmer is interested, which he is going to burn in the microcontroller. So if we are choosing assembly as a programming language, what are the benefits or what are the consequences? Uh, hex file would be smaller. Every, every programmer would love it, but the problem is programming is tedious and the time consuming. That means uh, if programmer is not uh, familiar with the right tactics in programming, assembly programming would definitely create a hard edge for him, right? And furthermore, it will uh, consume a very important resource, which is time itself. If we talk about C language, the big blunder which we'll have and which we'll face is basically the large size of hex file, right? When I say the large size, th that means the, if we are referring towards what hex file. So the size of hex file which are produced in C languages uh, or uh, which are produced by the compiler when they convert the C language program, they basically hex file size is very large. But the beauty of this is basically these are quite easier to manipulate because C language is well established language and one can easily manipulate the code without having uh, so much uh, techniques uh, as we need to implement them in a semi language. Okay, before uh, we further clarify this thing, let's uh, contrast the two languages, assembly and C, or what are the advantages if you are going to program in C? So first of all, as I uh, cleared it, it is easier to implement and less time, and less time consuming. So you are saving both, both the ends. You are uh, providing comfort to the programmer and you are providing, uh, you are having a very less amount of time, right? Then furthermore, very important fact, modification and updating the code is much easier, which was very difficult in case of assembly. You know that in case of single uh, attribute, if you want to modify it, you need to uh, write, write several number of lines is assembly code. But in C programming, you are uh, not supposed to do the same thing because the modification and updating the code is quite easier. Furthermore, the fact which is making it easier is basically the built-in library functions which are available in C and they are quite well developed and one don't need to worry about uh, the built-in uh, code because the, if you are not writing your own code and you are using customer uh, uh, custom available code, that means basically uh, you're saving the time. So this is the advantage of pro uh, programming in C for any microcontroller. Another and very important advantage that we are going to emphasize is basically the code that you have written in C, the C code is portable to any other microcontroller that you can easily shift uh, that code from one microcontroller to another microcontroller. And that is wonderful attribute of any C written code, right? Uh, Sometimes there, there are scenarios when you need to modify slight code, but 
uh, usually there is no modification required or if modification is required from uh, moving from one microcontroller to another microcontroller that would be very uh, slight modulation uh, modification and uh, some of them mostly include only header files because for example the code you have written for pick 18 f452 and now you are going to burn it into pick 18 f454 that means you need to change your header file so these are slight modifications which may be expected in uh, portability from one microcontroller to another microcontroller but believe me this is not an option for assembly language programming because uh, the code you have written the code the syntax you have used for one microcontroller would be very different from uh, for another microcontroller so, the, uh, so these are the advantages to program in c which were uh, never available in assembly language so that is why in this series we are going to focus on uh, uh, c programming uh, to program microcontroller okay that's it from this video tutorial uh, thank you so much for listening if you have any question please post them in comment section